Hi Ian, how are you all today? The question says, two tailors A and B earns rupees 150 and 200 per day respectively. A can stitch 6 shirts and 4 pants per day while B can stitch 10 shirts and 4 pants per day. Form a linear programming problem to minimize the labor cost to produce at least 60 shirts and 32 pants. So let us proceed with our solution. Here we have to minimize the labor cost. It means that profit is to be maximized, right? So here, let tailor A works for X days and tailor B works for Y days. So, our LPP is to maximize Z, that is 150X plus 200Y as A earns 150 whereas B earns 200 per day. Now here we have some constraints. So, constraints that are 6x plus 10y should be greater than equal to 60. That is 6 shirts which is stitched by tailor A and 10 shirts which are stitched by tailor B should be greater than equal to 60. Whereas 4 pants by tailor A and 4 pants by tailor B should be greater than equal to 32, right? And X and Y should both be greater than equal to 0. Now further, converting the above LPP into equations we have 6x plus 10y is equal to 60 which can be written as 3x plus 5y is equal to 30 right and further the second one is 4x plus 4y is equal to 32 which can be written as x plus y is equal to 8. Now, for these two equations, let us find out two points that we need to plot on the graph. Now, when x is 0, then the value of y is 6, whereas when y is 0, then the value of x is 10. Similarly, over here, we have when the value of x is 0, y is 8. And when y is 0, x is 8. Now let us plot these points on the graph. We have when x is 0, y is 6. That is 0, 6. And when x is 10, y is 0. Let us join these two points to obtain a line representing the equation that is 3x plus 5y is equal to 30. Similarly, we need to proceed on to the next equation that is this point 0, 8 and this point 8, comma. 0. Now, this line represents equation x plus y is equal to 8. 
Now these two lines are intersecting at point P where x, the value of x is 5 and the value of y is 3. So we see that z is maximum at point 3 that we will find out by finding out the value of z at 3 points that is at point A, P and let's say this point as B. So let us make a table. Points A, P and B are the three points that we are dealing with. Point A has the coordinates as 0, 8. P has 5, 3. And then we have 0, 8. Sorry, it was 6 and here it is 8. Now here we have the function Z as 150X plus 200y. Now, substituting the values here, we have for this point the value of z as 1200. Here we have the value of z as 1350. And here we have it as 1200. So, we can clearly see that z is maximum. at point P whose coordinates are 5 and 3. Therefore, Taylor, A works 5 days and Taylor, B works 3 days. Right, so this ends the session. Hope you understood the whole concept of this linear programming problem well and have a nice day.